Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Sammy Ketchum, and I'm back with another video. Today, we are going to bring you a deck profile video of Slack King Malamar. Yes, Slack King Malamar once again. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I woke up to the most fantastic news. Oh, man. I mean, I wake up, I check my phone, and I'm like, hmm, let me check YouTube. And what did I find on PTCG Radio was Ross doing a deck profile on Slack King Malamar. It has been doing well at some cups, and it's basically been changing, changing up things in the format, or literally shaking up things in the format. Oh my goodness, I am so happy. I've been telling people about this deck. I've been preaching to people about this deck. I said, Slack King is good. You know what I'm saying? We need this in a format. You know, ability lock. You know, it being active. It's attack being absolutely very good. Oh my gosh, I've been preaching this. And finally, finally, it has come to light. Oh man, I cannot tell you how happy I am right now. I literally just woke up, no coffee, no nothing, Built, rebuilt this deck from the ground up to basically fit the Lost Thunder meta. Now, don't get me wrong, there may be changes to this, you know, maybe in the coming weeks, you know, depending on what keeps coming out in Lost Thunder and seeing, you know, what happens during testing and things like that. But right now, I think this deck, with the cards that I put in it just now has a very, very great chance of standing against the meta. Alright, let's jump into this. We have three, three Slack King, ladies and gentlemen. And this is the main star of the show. His ability, Lazy, basically says, as long as this Pokemon is active, your opponent has no abilities. Well, no abilities that can come from their hand or anything. Well, if they if their abilities come into play, then you know they cannot they cannot activate. They have no abilities, ladies and gentlemen. This is ability lock. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to have a Pokemon tool attached to it to basically get it going. All you have to do is have this have slacking active. That's it. That is it. Alright, um, his attack critical move for three colorless energy, 160. Discard an energy attached to this card and you cannot attack your next turn. Well, of course, we can always get around that. And we've been able to get around that for years. So, let's move on. Got one copy of Vigoroth. You know, I'm evolving to your Pokemon. You always got to have... You always got to have that stage one. I mean, even if you're playing forward, Kenny, you always got to have it. You always got to have it. Got to have insurance. We've got three. Slack off. Slack off is the pre-evolution of slacking. So we've got to have him in here. We've got three Malamar, ladies and gentlemen. If you're running slacking, you run Malamar with it. Basically, this is partially the energy acceleration of this deck. It helps get helps get Slack King going. It helps get your other Pokemon in this deck going. And we're going to talk about more about that later. Three NK to go with your Malamar. And the this is two new techs in this deck that will deal with Buzzhole and that will deal with Shrine. And all those variants that basically, the fighting variants that basically harp on Slack King that are weak to Psychic, the Yoxes. The Yoxes will take care of those matchups for you. Even though Slack King won't be active, like, when if you go up against them, like, hey, this will take care of that for you. You maybe hit maybe a turn or two against them with this, and then you bring up Slack King after that, you know, the cleanup. I mean, you've got it. You know what I'm saying? You've got it. Um, also, for a notable mention, you can also maybe take one of these out and maybe play a Giratina. You know what I'm saying? Giratina's not bad in one of these slots either. 
You know what I'm saying? So I think this is a great, great, great meta call. You know, to stick in this deck to counter to counter that. We have one Tapu Lele GX. Of course, I would like to fit in two, but one is just fine. Um, to find a supporter in your deck, which is very good. Self-explanatory. Right now, we play one copy of Don Wings Necrozma GX. This is basically a great partner for slacking. Um, its invasion ability lets you rush in and switch out basically your slacking. Bring it back to the bench. With Malamar, you can power it back up. And with Altar of the Moon, you can basically retreat this Dawn Wings. Bring back out the Slack King you just attacked with and attack with them again because when the Slack King goes on the bench, it resets the attack. So he can attack the next turn, which is very, very great. Very, very great shenanigans. Also, to note, Dawn Wings and Cosmos Moon Eclipse attack is basically, is basically like a winning condition of this deck. Do not sleep on that GX attack in this deck. It is very, very good. One copy of a Rangaroo just to get, you know, your draws going if your hand gets low. We play three Cynthia. Self-explanatory. We play two copies of Lily. Lily is great in the beginning of the game to possibly draw you eight cards. Also, Lily is also good in this deck because you run stage twos. If you have like a if you have like a piece of the evolution in your hand and you need to get rare candies or you need to get the other part of the pieces, you can basically draw them with Lily. It is very, you know, very good in this deck. Two copies of Tate and Liza. I really like this card in here. Um, with the two options you have, you can either shuffle your hand in or you can switch out your Pokemon. Being able to switch out your Pokemon is actually really key in this deck. Is what this deck is made for. You know, so two Tate and Liza's are very, very good. Going with either option, you can't go wrong with that. Two copies of Judge. I mean, Disruption is always good. Um, actually, I would actually like to go with a Marshadow Let Loose. But this deck, you know, this deck is really bad on bench space. So two Judge is just fine. Um, I like it. Three Guzma. I mean, self-explanatory, Guzma wins games. You're going to steal games with Guzma. And Slack King. <laughs> All right. This is a new tech from Lost Thunder, Professor Elm's Lecture. This card, ladies and gentlemen, works basically as a Bridget for this deck. Basically, it lets you search your deck for three basic Pokemon. Well, three Pokemon that are, that are 60 HP or less. This searches out your Malamars. This searches out your Slack Offs. This is bloody brilliant in this deck. Oh my goodness. This card is basically going to really propel your opening beginning games. I cannot stress this enough. This is going to be awesome. For Ultra Ball. Self-explanatory. can get any Pokemon in your deck. Discard two cards. <clears throat> Psychic Energies. Two copies of Timer Ball. Timer Ball to help you find your evolutions. You've got Slack King in here. You've got Vigorov. You've got your Malamars with your evolutions. You really need to have that. You really need to have those options. This is very, very good in this deck. I mean, you usually can, usually basically can always get one heads on this. So, I mean, it's not bad. It's very good. Three copies of Choice Band. Basically, for Slack King and your Dawn Wings to basically hit for numbers on your opponent's Pokemon. 
I mean, it helps Slack King hits for 190, which is very, very good. Very, very good. Um, 190 basically takes out Buzzhole. It takes out Blacephalon. It takes out Rayquaza GX. Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be great. One copy of Rescue Stretcher. I mean, self-explanatory. Three copies of Altar of the Moon. To help retreat and switch out your Pokemon. This is basically the combo with this deck. With Malamar, with Slack King, with Dawn Wings and the Cosma, and this. Man, you have some great plays up your sleeve. Especially with Guzma, with Tate and Liza. It's switch. This is this is great. You know what I'm saying? You're doing so many shenanigans. You're going to surprise people. Four copies of rare candy to help speed the process of evolving your slack kings. I mean self explanatory. Two copies of switch to help switch out your Pokemon even more. This works with Alter the Moon. This works with Gosma. You name it. We have six. Six Psychic Energies to power up your Pokemon. And to round out the deck, we have three Double Colorless Energies to also help speed things up. So you won't have to go, oh, uh, Malamar, Malamar, energy for the turn. You can just go double colorless or Malamar for the turn. Or, you know what I'm saying, or you could do a combination of that, which is very good in this deck. Yeah, I mean, people will be playing Enhanced Hammer. Some decks might, you know, but, you know, we got Malamar too. So we've got, we've got a lot of great options as far as energy goes. Um, also, I have some notable mentions that can also be in the deck that you you know that can take part in this deck um an extra copy of tapu lele um um you could sub this out for one of the cards in the deck i mean a second tapu lele isn't bad you know so i mean it's always needed you know um a copy of field blower just to get rid of either opposing stadiums or 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 item cards or tool cards that are on your opponent's Pokemon. I mean, it's always good to have, you know, at least one in the deck, you know. It's, you know, it's like one of the 60, 61st options. Um, Energy Lotto. Energy Lotto, I think, is a very great tech. Um, it'll help you find um, your double colorless energies in the deck. It'll help you find your psychic energies in the deck. Um, I think it is. I think it is a very good tech. Um, I may be subbing maybe a couple in. Who knows? You know, we'll make some. You know, we'll play some games. You know, do some tests. But you know, I like it. So it's definitely an option. And then, last but not least, um, maybe a third Professor Elms lecture, just so you can basically find. You know, find it on, you know, on your beginning turns. You know, I mean, basically, it's good. You're going to, basically, you're going to Lele for this every single time in the beginning of the game. But, you know, just in case, if you don't want to Lele it, hey, you know, you can find it in your opening hand. You might as well. You know, so. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is the deck. Man, I am very happy to bring this to you guys. Um, I definitely will be testing this out for the Lost Thunder meta. Um, I definitely will be surprising people with this. Um, definitely at challenges. Maybe even at cups if I get a chance to go if I get off work. <laughs> but I like this. I like this deck so much. Slack King is going to hurt people. <laughs> it's going to destroy people. They're going to be hurt because they can't get off their abilities. And I am going to absolutely love it. Alright guys, as always, like, 
comment, subscribe. And as you know, you can go beyond your limits. Go beyond Plus Ultra.